Hey guitar friends, we got quite a bit of cool picking today. I'm gonna to show you how to play White Horse by Chris Stapleton. We'll play it with the capo on the fourth fret. The chord positions we'll play here are A minor, C, G, and we'll play F. We're just gonna be playing the fourth, third, second, and first strings for the F in this. Our intro is gonna start out on the A minor. First, if you just wanna strum this, you could do down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. You could also do down, down, up, down, up. Here's what the picking for the A minor sounds like, then I'll explain what I'm doing. So we're starting out on the fifth string and going five, four, then first string. And I'm picking the first string here with my third finger and then going three, four, then one, three, four, one, three, four, then one again, then four, and then the second string here, I'm gonna add my fourth finger here on the third fret to end that. Then we're gonna start on the fifth string again, do the same thing, five, four, one, three, four, one, three, four, one, three, four. Then we're gonna to go to the first string, third fret. Pick that and then go four, and then back to the first string, open. So here's that second part again. So one more time, here's that A minor picking. That's how our intro starts out with that picking, and then we're gonna go into this lick. And all that is played over the A minor chord. So starting on the sixth string open, pick that, then hammer onto the third fret. Then pick the fifth string open twice. Then back to the sixth string, third fret. Then fifth string open again. Then fifth string, third fret, we're gonna pick that and we're gonna pull down to bend it. And then we're gonna pull off to open it back up. And then go back to the sixth string, third fret, then fifth string open one more time. So here's that once more slowly. play that over the A minor chord. Then we'll go into our first verse. We're gonna go F, C, G, A minor for the first verse. So here's what that sounds like. This love is getting kinda dangerous. Feels like it's low gone. And we can do some hammer-ons here for the F chord. We can hammer on the third string open to second fret. For the C chord, we can hammer on the fourth string open to second fret. And if you want, you can add your third fret on the first string down here while you're playing that C also. Then for the G, we can hammer on third string open to second fret and then come back off. Here's the next part of the verse. My mind is turning like a cloud of dust. My heart always wants to run. Go A minor. Then we'll just mute the strings by removing our chord position and lightly touching the strings here to mute them. 
Then here we go to the G chord to go into the chorus. We're gonna change up our strumming a little bit. So for the G chord, we'll go down, down, up, up, down, up. Then just do one down strum on the A minor. And then go to the F chord and go down, down, up, down, up. Do the same thing for the C, down, down, up, up, down, up, then A minor, one down strum, then we'll go to the G and go down, down, up, down, up. So here's how we play through the chorus. If you want a cowboy on a white horse, riding off into the sunset, that's the kind of love you want to wait for. Hold on tight, girl, I ain't there yet. No, I ain't there yet. No, I ain't there yet. You can play the lead lick here if you want it. Why? Go back to the F to go into the next verse. Someday, maybe you could have your way. Right now is just not the time. Some things hands just got to do. Change my mind. Oh, 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 oh. If you want a cowboy, we'll play through the chorus again, and then we have our instrumental. So we'll play the same chords as the chorus, then we'll play through the chorus two more times, and we'll end our song on the A chord. I appreciate you being here and learning with me. If you want to continue learning and improving, there's some cards right here you can click on, and I'll see you in another video.